That's a straw hat. Is it not? Survivor camp. Who the fuck are you yelling at? This guy? I don't think this is a straw hat guy. It's just a survivor camp. Here, you, you continue having your little like adventure back down there and yelling at each other. I'll, I'll take care of that later. My lord, maybe you can talk sense into them. Tell me what this is about. Oh, reckless, did you want to join? Uh, John, can you end it? Yeah, no problem. I got you, G. Uh, reckless, you weren't able to connect to join. It looks like a little bit late. So here, I'll, I'll restart and you can try it again. I always try to make the timer not too, too long. Uh, but it might need to be longer for some people. It really just depends. Alright, basketball. And then go nuts. Why isn't Reckless able to join for some reason? Exclamation point join space the color you want to play. What the fuck? Huh. Really, really weird. It won't let him join. Wait, there you are. Yeah, there you are. I was just delayed. Okay, so... Well, or you, do you guys want to verse each other, or did you just want to choose who goes AFK in there? What the fuck? That's, okay. Here, what, let me change it for a second. Let me change basketball to, like, a, like a, a little bit of a longer delay. Auto balance timer starts in 25 seconds. Let me change that to like a minute. And then points to win, things 10 minutes. Yeah, okay, so now it should be 60 seconds for you to be able to join. There you go. Yeah, now you got one minute to join. This should be a little bit easier now. All right, and then there's Ryan, and then there's Reckless. Okay, there you guys go. So, so it looks like for some reason you guys disappear once you join, and it looks like that also another thing is too is that uh, when when we start the basketball thing, it does auto balance regardless anyways. So I think as long as you're willing to join uh as long as even if you don't specify the team if you just hit join i think it'll just auto put you in the lobby but it looks like you're in there now just to get a longer countdown now i guess that's fine but yeah let's temporarily run double xp so anybody that wants to get double xp right now and uh get just as much coins as they get in the stream avatar as they do in the discord uh then right now i'm offering it well, what well, would we, we, be kind of funny? You know what? We'll do that from now on. Every now and again, we'll run double XP weekends on the mini games. There you guys go. It's Thanos versus uh, Goku inside of uh, basketball. Who will win? And it's funny seeing your guys' giant sprites being flung corpse launch style. It's just funny just seeing Thanos fling in the air. Alright, I think this is a hot spring. Yeah, it is. Uh, where's the sitting part? Here we go. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, you get to look at Jin's ass once more. You know, maybe Jin's the one with the dump truck. <laughs> My poison... Excelled, uh, ex uh, excelled. I know what I'm saying, but yeah, basically kicked out of the samurai. What should I focus on? The poison seems like it's most important to the focal point, so I'll say that.
I wonder if you can ever go back and hear the dialogue for oh, another thing if you don't pick it the first time around. Like, for example, can I reflect getting kicked out of the samurai thing ever again, or is, or do I have to oh, choose to hear to one piece of dialogue over the other? I'm just curious. I, I don't know if it would ever do that. So. Uh, what about the one that's, like, super, like, low on the island? There's a piece of, the, uh, like, a question mark really, really low down here. Like, all the way down here. So we're gonna check that out. Yo, I'm surprised that you two can even fit your sprites in that basketball hoop. It's not really that big. Thanos has got a giant-ass fucking, th like, forehead, so... Yeah, the green lines the hoop, not the star. The star tells you how the game works. So on a, a, a thing of 0 to 180, that shows you where your trajectory is going. So you do a set of numbers between 0 and 180, space, and then another set. And that arcs your body for where it's going to fling. So 0, or sorry, rather like 180 is like the one side, and then 0 is the other side. And then uh, 80 is in the middle. Or, or is that 90? But yeah, basically the left hand numbers flings you more to the left and kind of like lower and then the other ones do higher up and more to the right. I think the left hand numbers, if I'm not mistaken, traject your, your angle, like your, like your left or right, and then your second ones do your height. That's what it is. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's how it works. But don't take my word for it because I haven't necessarily looked into it that much. It's just numbers. You don't add in a letter. Who are you guys? Who the hell are you back here? Oh, you're Mongols. We're fighting the fucking ocean. Oh, you want to swing fast. All right, homeboy. That was still too early? Fuck were you aiming? So it looks like one of those things back there. Well, don't worry, Reckless. You still got five minutes. Ten minute game, so. Pillar of Honor. Dude, that one instrument that they always use sounds super fucking fun. Yeah. Like, I don't know what the hell it is. Like, the, uh, the guitar-shaped thing they use with the strings. Like, I don't know what instrument that is in Japanese culture, but it's cool. Can you stop interrogating each other? Yeah, just wait, hold on, it's that instrument. Where the fuck? Who which one is playing one? Tell me. We don't know. When he's playing that instrument, where is it? How dare you? Yeah, you. What is this instrument? My lord, maybe you can talk sense into them. Tell me what this is about. It makes such a funky sound. Like what the hell is that? It look Especially that one. It's like a banjo guitar violin shape, but She's using like a thing to pluck the strings that looks like a rake. What the hell is that thing? What are you, sh what are you scraping it with? It's like a piece of wood. Such a bizarre, like a bizarre instrument. Like the, the sound is in, like indescribably like unique. Huh. 
Alright, Jen. Shit. Almost had it. So far, it looks like that Ryan's actually doing pretty well on the uh, basketball, but you can you can still get the reckless. I believe in both of you. But what we'll do is we'll be do like a best two out of three. I'll give reckless a second chance by loading in twice. How the fuck do I jump? Where am I jumping to? Over there? Or am I going up? Or am I going down? Where the hell am I going? Alright, well the straw hat guy... May or may not be somewhere. Oh, Ryan, did you miss? Omega lol. Right, I see more steam. It might be another one of those uh, springs. Oh, no, it's just a lady. Or a guy. Oh, it's Lady Mazako. So I found one of her missions. The fool. Uh, I'll go back to you later, Lady Mazako, because I got a different agenda that I want. Jen, over here, quickly. So yeah, Ryan, you got uh, 800 gold. Indeed. I said it was double XP. You got the double XP for the, the winning and also being the MVP. So that's what you got, my G. Here, I'll do another one, so we'll do best two out of three, and let's just see if uh, Reckless you can uh, do better in this one. Wait, I'm playing a game. Oh, wait. No problem. What the hell is that fine? Here, I'll just, uh, I'll temporarily end it then, and I'll, I'll uh, restart later when you're ready. Oh, you gotta go, Ryan? Ah. Uh, well, hey, thank you for tuning in, though, Ryan. I greatly appreciate you, bro. I know it's uh, later for you, so I thank you for stopping by. So high five, my G, and I will see you again sometime soon for another live stream, homie. I think what I will do, though, guys, I will look up the uh, Straw Hat guys, like their locations, just simply because of the fact that, um, you know, that was the main uh, idea behind the stream, and I did quote that I was going to do them all, and it's already been over an hour. So... I'll, I'll keep looking. Rather than, uh, like, just assuming, I'll actually, like, type it in and I'll look it up manually. Because I want to make sure I, I get them, like, really soon from each other. Because I have to find five of them and I've only done the one. Who are you? Oh, it's just the guy's fighting the fucking bear. Yeah, you, you have fun with actually. I'm just gonna kill you. I, if the bear was gonna lose, then I'm gonna kill you. Oh. 
Alright, homies. See what we got. I ran past it. Fuck. I wasn't trying to necessarily be lazy or whatever. I just didn't want to take away from the stream just to look things up originally. But in hindsight, it, like, it makes it flow better for the gameplay. I have a little bit of a temporary pause just to know exactly where I'm going. Don't need to have to necessarily worry about finding it perfectly on my own. Uh, that was a... Okay, I legitimately am used to thinking that that was a deer. But because I played a Shrek Zombies map in Black Ops 3 recently, I thought that was a fucking donkey. Okay, so what is the mission officially called? The Six Blades of... Okay, I got you. The Six Blades of whatever the hell it is. Let me look this up. I just need to know where they are and then just find that and like basically just TP there. I'm just gonna say the six straw hat location. The six straw hat location. The six straw hats. Straw hat duels, yeah. So will you show it on their map? Please tell me he shows it on his actual map, though. Okay, good. It is right in the corner near the lighthouse. I believe the good news is you can ping things in this game. So it's like here, I think. So this is near the one castle, though. Wait, hold on. Ah! It's over here, I think. Let me see. Wh wh which castle is near? Castle Shimura. Yeah. Wait. Oh, no, it does count. Okay, never mind. My apologies. So you can do them out of order, then. I wonder what happens if you just don't activate the quest, then, but you kill all the straw hats. Does it like, just auto-give you the reward, then? I don't know. Anyway, but yeah, I knew I killed some straw hats before. Okay, so he's dead, and the other guy at the bottom is dead, so let me do another one. Let, let it go by. And then this is the guy I, also, I literally just did. So he was down here. Then there's one at like a rosy area. I actually am really close to that area. It's by default. It's like down the lower left. Like in between. It's like in the one part here. Like down here, the uh, Yumji area. Yeah, uh, I dueled him. So I might have already done most of these guys. Uh, there's one area in a waterfall which I don't believe I've seen that one's at the coast coast this is down here I think yeah the coast Yeah, it's right here near Lady Massacre. So I actually ran past this one. So that guy I had to take care of. That's that's 100% certain. I 
And then there's the one at the village, I think. Let me just take care of the one that I've yet to do first. Because there's another one over here by the one village. Like, down here. And I've also have two done that one. So I've got that guy, that guy. Wait, that's. Wait. Got that guy, and then this one. There's one more guy by like a beach pond area, which I also think I've taken care of too. I think that the last one is the one I saw first. So yeah, I got like one more guy left. And it might just give it to me. But it looks like from seeing this cutscene, I don't see the demon dude you face. I just think it's I think that's just maybe a legend or maybe something later. And it looks like I only got one straw hat left. Uh, and this is this guy near Lady Mazako. So I'll just TP to her if I can, or can I not? The one duel is like back, basically back to back. Not complete. So yeah, that's the duel itself. Wait, so never mind, it's not that. That's the duel down here. Okay. So let me teleport to here. And let me close this video out. Okay. Uh, chat splitter, am I able to scoop you up so you don't get run over? I'm trying to avoid you getting damaged by scooping you up, but I don't know if like that will tie you up in a knot and damage you. So it's this guy down here. This is not complete, so that's good to know. I'm glad though that it does backlog, cause now I can fight less people. So, so technically, I've never really was losing time. I actually was already saving time, cause I was doing the quest without even knowing it. So never mind. My bad. should be down by the waterfall you're like underneath of it i think yeah so which means i do i get eventually get down there but i don't know how to get to you i'll have to figure that out shortly in a second there's rocks hopefully Here, let me see yeah So he should just be down here, right? <coughs> Excuse me. There he is. So you must be able to go in here without sinking. Hi. Uh, uh, you're welcome. I, I appreciate you being polite about this at least. Thank you for choosing the nice scenery, I guess, too. I like water. I like waterfalls and shit like that, too. Lord Saka. Thanks for coming. <sighs> or maybe by process of elimination, I become the sixth swordsman once I complete the original five straw hat guys. I love how Jin just pulls out the sword and you just like know shit's about to go down. Alright, come here, straw hat. Damn it. Damn it. Okay. Okay, okay, that's something I also didn't know about the uh, the abilities. That it only re will give you um, your resolve taken away if you actually hit the move, so you don't ever waste it. Really, that's good. All you do is just put yourself in danger of anything. Uh, well, I mean, I understand, but it doesn't mean I have to like it. I'm gonna keep using my overpowered abilities on you. 
I hope you understand. This is just a job. I don't understand how that I can't mess him up by uh, hitting him. Like I, I can hit him and it stuns him sometimes, and then I can hit him. But like it doesn't mess him up like the other guys normally is, where I can just stun him or heal. But then again, though, it's a boss fight, so I mean. I can get him if I have certain timing or certain combos. See, like, now I got really low. Gotcha. Oh, never mind. I thought I could slide into you like the other guy. Oh, I did. It's just that he came to me. Bye-bye. See you, straw hats. I thought they were all dead, by the way, anyway. Duel under the falling water. So, is that it? Are all straw hats? Yeah. Speak to the musician at uh, Yumji Cove. You are down... All the way back down here. Okay. Thank God for fast travel, too. I need to face the I'm to glad I can just me. ping an area that I've already been to and just fast travel there. It's so good. Oh yeah, so I gotta talk to the original guy that I spoke to that got permission from the first place. Okay, so as you're playing your really cool instrument, let me uh, figure out where the uh, other dude is. Lord Sakai, thank the gods. Straw hats that Kozio wanted me to do are dead. He already knew, my lord. I told you. Yeah, we'll see no about ordinary that. ordinary man. You saw him again. He came back. Thanks, homie. Told me you earned death by his hand. Yo, is he actually he a demon, though? Because, like, that's, that's something I'm curious about. Can I also even get his armor, too? That'd be kind of cool. Where is he? He's back in my my place? You like, back over by Lady Masako again. Yeah, he's, like, in my my area with my buddies. You'll never tire in battle. We'll see about that. What happens if I also earn ghost stance? Can I just scare the shit out of the demon like I did the one straw hat dude? That was cool when I found out you could use ghost stance on them. So let's go. I'm gonna travel to Lady Mazako. I'm not gonna accept her mission, I'm just using her as a fast travel point. By the way. Wasn't there missions back on the first island that involved me uh, having side quests with like certain characters that are not alive anymore, like Taka? Like I see the the the, the one dude and then Lady Mazuko, but I think there was originally some with Ta uh, Taka. Uh, Taka. I was gonna say Takio, and then I already knew that that was wrong. So instead of saying Taka, I just continued with that because I was already in the middle of saying it. I ended up getting Taco. <laughs> That's so bad. I, I, I promise that I didn't mean to say that. Oh, dear. It was Kenji. <laughs> no Taco, though. Uh, the old dude and Lady Mazak. I wonder if you and I ever did any side quests down here. I already did a couple of Lady Mazako quests. It says there's a couple of them. Like, yeah, there's like two of nine... And, she, and she's up here right now. Five of nine. I've done a lot of her quests. I might just do her origin st stories uh, along with the other guy's characters too. I've done none of Kenji even though he only has three. I, I need to do those character origin stories also too. That would also give me another thing to do. Just figure out what they're all about. Especially the one old dude because he's the reason that the, the group even came back. Never really got to thank him for that. All right, G. Fight me. Sup. Sup.
Dude, I feel like we would fucking trip on these lights everywhere. These candles floating on pieces of wood in the water here. The music. I feel like we would just burn our fucking feet. We get like hot wax everywhere. Do you believe? Especially the dude that's barefoot right now. I think you should have stayed a legend. By the way, how is his armor blessed by demons? It looks like he's wearing like a fucking cloth. My armor is actually like armor. His is just literally like a fucking bed sheet. I mean, I'm, I have no resolve going into this, but I mean, it's only the second island. I feel, I'm pretty sure I can get him. Uh, let me heal, by the way, with one. If I just juke him out, I'm fine. Yeah, that was stupid putting your fucking sword away. Why are you putting your sword away? I did make a little bit of a mistake going in here without resolve, but that's fine. Good for you, like I give a shit. You realize I'm still gonna kick your ass though, right? Especially since you keep putting your fucking sword away like an idiot. What tactic or advantage does that give you? By the way, I also noticed that if you just swing it repeatedly, I just need to block. It looks like you do gain resolve from these boss fights if you never kill an enemy, as long as you at least damage them, at least. I noticed that. Okay, you're about to, you got your back to me, so... Ooh, that was a good ability. Nice, nice, nice try, but I, now I stunned you, now I'm gonna wreck, wreck you. He's a demon for how evil he is, but that just sounds like a personal problem. Yeah, you're not gonna hit me if I just keep dodging you. Hey, bitch! I didn't right. tell you you can hit me. You're a demon. Yeah, just put your sword away like a did this. I just got resolved too. Good for you. I don't care. You're literally lucky just because I want to get the gameplay and I don't want to try to scavenge resolve right now that I'm going into this fight like this. I also could just block you, you know. I haven't enjoyed killing this much. Yeah. <laughs> 
like fucked him up there for a second. Like I messed him up. Damn it! I was trying to do the charged ability by holding down triangle, but uh, he swung too fast. Here, let me back up here. Let, come at me for a second. Men. Every hey, motherfucker! I didn't say you could swing. The musician was right. You are a demon. Oh, that was really that fucked him up. demon. Oh, I did the nut one. Oh, I killed my stab from the nuts. Oh, that was rough. Death by castration. Yep, and it looks like I immediately stole his armor. I don't necessarily know, Jin, why you would have the appeal in that, technically, when, you know, it's 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 already another curse thing that you don't necessarily need. And also the fact that no one said you should take it, or I don't see what the appeal could be for you, other than just maybe having possibly more power. So, yeah. Anyways, that's another one of those. And shouldn't I have the ability by now? The one mythic ability? It is a mythic ability, right? The blue one? So, Undying Flame and Complete Spirit of... Yeah, I think that's the one I'm thinking of doing. Now I gotta get out of here, right? Was, was I not doing that one mission? Was that not the mission? Was it not? Here, let, let me see. So, that's the particular mission that I need to complete? So, what, what gives me the other one, then? Can I only earn them in a certain order? This is complete by doing the Undying Flame one. And then that's the Spirit one. So what was the one I just did? And where the hell's the other one? Is it on the third island? It might be on the third island. But yeah, that, that one's, that's one's the where it is. Alright, well, I'll teleport there and I'll, uh, I'll just... Switch my armor, I guess. That's gotta be another mythic quest, and it's just not the main mythic quest, if that makes any sense. This is a cool armor, though. I mean, what's it like when you upgrade it? Ooh. That's kind of cool. But yeah, let me just, uh... Get a ghost headband. So, let's go over here. Come on, Cage. Yeah. 
So, okay, I'm surprised that that wasn't the one mythic quest. Guess we just haven't found it yet. Or maybe it is gotta be in order. But wait, that makes no sense because I did the one already out of order. The one on the very, very right. That was my first ability I got that was mythic. Yeah, we'll find it out. Still got around an hour. Hello. And the Vengeance one the one I'm looking for, right? Okay, the dance and rap. Tread carefully, my lord. Old Yaritawa is a dangerous place. Happened here? We were coming down the road and heard screams. cuts in. By the time we got here, it was too late. They must have killed each other. No. It was the spirit of Yaritawa's vengeance. Spirit? You know some of the tale, but not all. Long ago, the samurai of clan Yaritawa were the most skilled swordsmen on our island. In every generation, one lord was taught their family secret, a deadly technique called the Dance of Wrath that could cut through any foe's defense. The Dance of Wrath found its greatest master in Lord Tokiasa Yarikawa. Though beloved by his people, he resented Clan Shimura's power Desperate to seize control, he set off a bloody rebellion that claimed countless lives. Lord Shimura's father and brothers fell to Yaritawa's Dance of Wrath technique. But with Clan Sakai's aid, Shimura put down the rebellion and executed Lord Yarikawa. Before he died, the traitor vowed to avenge his conquered people. From beyond the grave. Now Neat they story. make offerings to his spirit at shrines in old Yarikawa's ruins. They beg for their enemies to die. And the These side quests aren't that Yarikawa's bad. They're almost like mini campaigns, like DLC. Their calls with the dance I really underestimate side quests. You believe these men were killed by that spirit? They were merchants. Known for cheating their customers, profiting from deceit. So someone prayed for their deaths. The shrines overflow okay. with offerings to the spirit, begging him for bloody retribution. How do I find these shrines? People burn a handful of straw in flower petals to make smoke, so the spirit finds their prayers. Look to the sky, my lord. Look for the white smoke. My G, they all look fucking white. Yaritawa's people haven't forgotten your clan's role in their downfall. That was a long time ago. Not to them. Is it over here? That looks pretty damn significant, unless that's just all the fog. What are the chances that we actually fucking find this just first try? The white smoke. Am I, am I out of order? No, 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 I'm not out of order. Wait, hold on. So yeah, it's just anywhere within this yellow circle. It, yeah, in a minute. Sorry, my dad needs to borrow my keys. Hold on. Probably someone that's parked in or something like that in our driveway.
plan. We can just leave it on the table if anyone wants their hand. Yeah, we're done. Uh, just, just a couple of people. It's only just two people. Just uh, Reckless and Ryan. Reckless and Ryan. <laughs> I'm the old man. I'm Moab. My old icky balls. Appreciate that very much. <laughs> well, if they don't, if they if it pissed them off, tell them I won't do it again. <laughs> now they like you. All right, all right, bye bye. Right. And ladies and gentlemen, that is my father. <laughs> Who would have thought that my dad would become like the biggest like icons of the fucking channel? I love how I can just walk away from my controller and the chat splitter just doesn't make any static. Oh, it's like so amazing. Yeah, definitely it was better to get the, the new chat splitter and a new controller because I feel like if I only got one, still would have the problems. Because the PS5's headphone jack just felt loose in general. Like I would plug in my headset without the splitter and it would still not register sometimes. White smoke. How am I supposed to tell what is exactly the white smoke? Yes, stomach. I know you're hungry. I'll feed you later. The white smoke. It's a lot of surface area to walk through here. I'm just gonna walk it up. Like, I just, I just don't want, I just don't want to bother. So we look it up. Thank God for modern technology is making it easy. I understand there's gotta be some appeal just looking around, but like. I'm just gonna look it up. So let's see. Uh, ghost white smoke. All four locations. Oh, there's multiple. All right. So it looks like that there is scrolls, and I gotta find them like on these like little table areas. Stop! Stop going by so fast. You, you only show it for like a second, dude. Hold on. It says it says we're at 1080, but the video is not rendering in yet. So it's like right next to the campfire, like right down here. If it'll fucking let me. Right, so let's go back down here. Wait, I see one. I already see one in general. Hold on. Okay, now I see what they mean by the white smoke. So I gotta remember, I'm gonna get this one on like the upper left. I gotta remember that I already got this one. But yeah, so here's one. I wonder if it matters if you get it out of order or not. Probably not, but let's see. Help the people of the old Yanakawa. The Mongols enslave our people. They camp along Kushi River, not far from the shrine. Destroy them. Someone left a message for the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. And then I gotta search again. Wait, did the thing shrink? Or is it just one of possible locations? The Mongols you see that, right? Our people. The circle got the significantly the smaller. From the shrine. Destroy them. This and is now it's saying, uh, now it's giving me a location of where to go. So, oh. So it was one of possibly four locations and I just got lucky. Okay, shit. Nice. I got fucking lucky. Nice. fire down here yeah I figured so what the hell happened here which I have because I kill them all the time Oh, 
hell's a person in here? The spirit cut down the horses. Shield Where are you? It took impressive skill to kill them. Not Mongols. Ours. Why were they killed? Let me out. Please, my lord. Calm down. I'll free you. Yeah, you're welcome, G. Tell me Bye -bye. what happened. The spirit. It cut through them all. Oh, wait. So there is multiple locations then. I I was going to die is that it? Who were these people with the Mongols? Wait, if hold on. Let me swipe me to death, You're free. Is it? Go. Another shrine. Thank you. Okay, never mind. So there is the multiple locations for the smoke. Comes to another shrine. Okay. So let, let me let me read look up the video then. So I know, yeah, I know about the one near the campfire, so I gotta remember about that location. Well, it's also, I just shouldn't just be afraid to just look up at the same time while I am actually doing this. Wait, wait what's this comment say? Find the white smoke. 90% of the search area is covered in white fog. Yes, yes, absolutely. Like, oh my god, dude, perfectly stated, just right there with that comment. Like, yeah, it could have been black smoke, because black smoke for, like, a fire would make more sense with this, because this is burning. But why is it white? Like, black smoke makes sense for a fire. It also makes sense for where I'm looking for, but... Nah, apparently my G is just like, nah, let's look for the white smoke. When the 90% of it is fog. It's like, come on. Looks like more smoke. It definitely is in the right direction. Yeah, I see a fire going too. This is the right area. I'm almost positive of it. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Well, it's also the, the light looked like a, uh, a fire. I did. You see anybody run through here recently with a vengeance? Search the camp for the traitor. Smoke. Hetero Smoke. is the traitor to our people. He's at the camp nearby. End his worthless life. Jesus Christ, these guys have like no remorse or hold back for their insults like god i like, really want them to die and vengeance. suffer someone left a message i'm also getting a bad feeling that this is also our people they're referring to it's like it's our people that have died so far and this place also is not the one on fire so is this the right one then Peter was a traitor to our people he's at the camp nearby his worthless life. They must mean the survivor camp. Oh, it is the right one. Lord Sakai, how can we help you? Which one of you is Hetaro? I am. Someone asked the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance to kill you. Why would they do that? He's a Mongol spy. I mean, he looks harmless. Won't say it's, not like, it's not like he also picked up the butcher knife as he fucking walked away. The Mongols, I will find out. I would never do that. Please, let me prove it. Make him confess, my lord. I'll explain, but not here. Follow me. I wonder how often a lot of these myths out in the world are just like actual people that me. were like just like really good at doing what I'm they real. do and people just thought they were just supernatural because it was so uncommon. Really? Where? On the road. Three bandits tried to rob me. The spirit cut their throats and vanished.
This is where I come at night, my lord. A grave. Who's buried here? His name is Tojiro. We were close. But his wife and family were at the camp. I can't explain why I visit without hurting them. I understand. But the people at your camp don't. So now we're also scared. still doing this yet again. It's not safe for you. Where else can I go? Okay, so... Make your way he's just grieving over a friend, and go. then he, uh... Before it's too late. People think that he's suspicious, but really it's just him just going to pray over his buddy, I guess. Alright. Let's look for more smoke. Which... That looks a lot like smoke, but it usually seems higher up in the air. Like... Really high up in the air. Is the circle also moving too, by the way? Like, oh, that seems like another area that's awfully suspicious. And so is that. Especially this one. But, like, does the smoke, like, fucking... Like, happen to be near survivor camps all the time? Or is that not a guarantee? Okay. Let's see. Near an abandoned village, that's for certain. I thought I heard something. So he, so so there was a message here, and I did hear something close by. One hundred. I heard that from all the way over here. Was, was that back at the old camp? There was a message here. I hear something. The already claimed it. it sounds closer, not farther, though. Follow the sounds of combat. It's just a little bit over the hill, I guess? Okay. I wonder what the message said, though. Why, why was it taken? I wonder what the fourth one is. It's also to the last one. Uh. Down here. Ow. That hurts. Mission gone resolve, but it's tight. I am the ghost after all. I don't hurt. <laughs> as far as you know. Alright, well, let me put this away then temporarily so I can see some stuff. Is he in this house? Probably. Hello? Hello? Is he in here? He's definitely in here. Is there an entrance in here? Hello? Oh. Oh, he escaped. Really? Too late. The killer's gone. So yeah, it's a person. Been living here for a long time. Warned by somebody. Are you guys able to hear the vacuum? Yeah, that's fucking loud. Written by an educated hand. Yo, hold on. But the words are nonsense. Something about the Lord Yeriko being alive. I mean, I know, I know I'm normally streaming at, like, 2 to 5, but, like, uh, I don't, I don't know why my mom would, like, vacuum when she knows I'm live streaming. Oh! 
Oh, that's from the that's the clan from the fucking beach that they're talking about. Like all the samurai being dead back from the beginning of the game. That's what that might be. Ooh, someone might be alive then. That's a fellow samurai. I just hope he's a good guy. Uh, we got one more left to find. Samurai of Clan Yariko was alive. So one more shrine with a piece of fog. This is probably where we'll meet the guy and then we'll fight him for the uh, his ability. All right, spirit. So where are you? I doubt they put the smoke in the, in the middle of the map, like, but it's still better than the edge of the map. It's probably in between the middle and the edge. That's not it. Yeah, with the fog everywhere, though, it definitely makes this a lot fucking harder. <laughs> I wonder how long the night cycle is in Ghost compared to the uh, other games I play. Like, how long it stays, it stays night and day and all that shit. smoke jet where the hell is the smoke at you know so let me just slide my mic closer maybe so that way if i'm not speaking as loud of an octave i can still be heard i swear to god it sounded like jin said yeet <laughs> not gonna lie when he jumped Alright, smoke. Where are you? No, that's out of the map, though. Yeah, that's out of the border. So it's gotta be in this way. Yeah, so it's gotta be this way. Well, I see a fire area, so there should be smoke also nearby it. That's not a guarantee, but usually it's close together. Right? Yeah, it looks like a fire. Or at least it's a tower with a fire. So the smoke should be close by. Like, would it not be? Here's a, uh, a building that has, like, a possibility of having the guy here, maybe. Survivor camp, right? Or one of the farm areas? Might be. Oh, I'm slightly getting out of the border again. Okay, so let me go back to over here then. What if I just cut through the middle? Hey! Solid! Sub G! Hey! What's up, man? I haven't seen you in a really long fucking time. What's up? How you been? What's up, man? How was, uh, how was your school stuff? Like, did you finally get that complete, dude? But then again, though, you probably don't necessarily want to talk about school. You probably want to talk about gaming and all that stuff. Oh, there's the smoke. What's up, man? Yeah, it's been a long time no see. How you doing, dude? There's been a lot of stuff that's changed since you've been gone, Solid. I gotta catch you up to speed, man. You usually stream at 4 a.m. in the morning my time. Well, that's why I intentionally streamed later on purpose today. Like, I started at 5 p.m. Eastern my time. So it was, like, easier for you and, like, people like uh, Banana Cake where he, like, lives in New Zealand or you in Australia. Yeah, I've been doing the 2 p.m. thing, uh, Sal, just because, like, uh, I was doing it predominantly because majority of my viewers are either from the United States or from uh, Europe. And that time worked better for them. I don't necessarily have as much people in Australia like you or New Zealand like uh, Banana Cake, but uh, I don't want my uh, viewers from other regions to get neglected, so that's why I started doing that again today. Probably what I honestly might do, Solid, is that uh, if you've been trying to get into a stream and it's been like 4 a.m. in the morning for you, dude, I might just mix my streams up and start doing some later again. Because we really have missed you on the channel. I understand time zones are a bitch, but I mean, like, it was just what was working at the time, man. But, uh, yeah, so I gotta catch up to speed, man. There's so many great things that's been going on. Like, uh, here, let, let me pause Ghost for a second. So, like, uh, we're almost at 2,000 subscribers on YouTube. We're, like, literally less than 10 away. Uh, we're almost at 250 Twitch followers. Which is really, really cool. I've added so many new things to the, uh, 
the chat over here like you'll see that now we've got these uh stream avatars here in the bottom middle where if you're a follower or a sub you get a background and you get like a little follower or like avatar dude that like walks around the screen and you can not only like have them there but you can also like have your chat pop so it looks like he's saying what you say you can do mini games uh so much of that is like really in depth and i like it a lot we've got the uh the jar over there the little donation jar uh i've got this which i call the yin yang wheel uh, what I do is that I can pull this up and if anybody ever asks me to spin it for them It's got like ten different things and it like ran, lands on something like really funny like an inside joke So it was like it can land on dad joke. It can land on nothing It can land on attention just a whole bunch of funny stuff uh, There's end credits now So at the end of my streams I roll like credits Star Wars style like saying who was here like all the thank yous and all that stuff uh, Another really cool one uh, What else? Uh, we got stream, uh, like, avatar, like, you know, pop-ups here and all that stuff. But there's also another thing is right here, I was going to say, right now it pops up. You can see that we've got, uh, uh, social media pop-ups now. We've got the YouTube, we've got the Discord, we've got the, uh, Twitter, we've got the Instagram, we've got the Twitch, and we even have a Reddit now. We have a Black Ninja Reddit. Uh, and there's Patreon, of course, and all that stuff. That all pops up now on the side to remind people to follow all of those, which is super, super cool. Uh, what else can I show you? There's so much to catch you up on, man. Uh, we've got channel uh, sounds or like sound alerts. Uh, I can't pull that up right now, but I could pull it up in just a second here. In fact, I will pull it up. Yeah, so there's channel alerts. Let me pull this up. So go to the Twitch channel. So yeah, basically what sound alerts are is that if you were to use like bits or whatever, like the channel currency, you can actually redeem them and you can actually make sound effects happen on the stream. So I'm going to look that up right now to show you. So Twitch sound alert dashboard. I'm just going to give an example of one. Let me pull it up. So configure. Open sound alert dashboard. I'm probably going to favor this tab to be honest. Just give it one second solid it's just loading me into my twitch account there we go so yeah now i have i have over 30 different sounds you can redeem for bits and like i'll play a couple of them as an example for you so so like one of them and this is probably one of my favorites is the fart sound so here i'll play in my obs or my <coughs> avatars or software uh so yeah there's the fart there's like applause so you got this one too there it is Uh, there's a couple of other ones too, like Illuminati. <laughs> so yeah, there's, uh, you can redeem those for bits, which are pretty cool. Uh, we also got things like in there, like jump scare scream and like Rick rolls. So there's a whole bunch with that. Uh, what else can I show you? Uh, there's so many new things you missed, man. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Oh, this one. This one's probably my favorite. So, um, another thing that we also have on the channel now is a be right back screen. I don't know if you've ever seen these, but it's like usually like when a streamer's yet, yet to start his stream, but he's got to go live or, uh, it's like sometimes when he takes a break. So I have hotkeys now where I can pull up these pre-done videos where I have it actually. So that way I have a pre-done video of me at my monitor and it just shows me like looking at my computer just like typing away so I'm not here. But I could also even do this where I move the chat over and it looks like your guys' chat is appearing on my monitor and I'm reading it. So I, so I can be like test and it pops up and it looks like I'm reading what you guys say. And, and it's super, super cool, man. I, I love all this new stuff. There's also just been some other stuff too. Like I've improved with like, just like learning, like get used to like my, my brand and like my personality, stuff like that. And when we apply to the channel, but there's so many new things, man. I got to catch you up to a date, man. There's so many cool new things I can show you. I gotta put that back. There we go. But yeah, there's just so many things, man. Uh, I see, uh, I noticed a lot of new things. LOL, I love it. Yeah, hey man, that's what I always try to do. I always try to make the streams feel like you're welcome at home. 
I even did some other things too, like for example, I got like a new chat splitter, uh, so that way my PlayStation doesn't make any static sound. I'm gonna take care of this one. I think what was happening is that like by just leaving it plugged into the Elgato and having a tangle in the wires, it just fucked it up for a long time. But I got a new PS5 controller and a chat splitter, so there's no static at all now. It's fucking amazing. It's like, oh, it's great for me too, because I don't have to deal with it either. Because before I used to like wrap it around the controller, so it was in a, just a niche spot, and it would wouldn't work or whatever, or it would work. Oh yeah, uh. I don't believe you also know what channel points are either. Okay, so this is also another thing. I don't know if you... Because there's so many things I completely forgot about that, like, I'm used to telling everyone. I, I don't believe you've seen this either. So, channel points. So, yeah, in the uh, this Twitch software right now, if you look it up in the corner, uh, there's a thing. There's, like, a little PNG of me. It's called Meme Coins. And what it is that every time you tune into the live streams... You basically build up, like, loyalty. It's like a loyalty rewards program, but it's for Twitch and it's free. Basically, what it is that when you tune into a stream, uh, and you have, like, a streak going, and you also stay in for a certain period of time, you interact and you talk and everything, you gain meme coins, as I call them, which is, like, channel points. And you can redeem them to actually be able to make me do certain actions. Like, one of them is, like, a, a no swearing challenge. The other one's, like, a, a drink water and hydrate. Uh, dropping loot in my game, so that way I have to, like, handicap myself. So many cool things you can do. You got the red PS5 controller. Uh, it arrived yesterday. Hell yeah, man. I got the classic white one, uh, cause when I got the new white one, uh, the PS5 red and black ones weren't out yet. PS5 controllers, or as controllers in general nowadays are really fucking expensive. They're almost as much or if more than a new game, so I was just good with keeping white, but, uh, yeah, I may or may not get red or black, cause those both look nice. I love them both. <laughs> they really do look nice. Ah, oh, what else did I improve? Uh, I changed the webcam so it's a little bit smaller, more sleek. Uh, in general, I've just made so that way my audio quality in general is like much better. I figured out this, this the balancing and stuff like that. Uh, we got a Nightbot. I don't know if you remember Nightbot. I don't know if you were there for the Nightbot. But uh, yeah, we got a Nightbot on the channel now that like interacts with everyone and uh, can act, act like as a mini mod. So he'll censor stuff and like get rid of spammers or he'll talk to you. Or you can even at him. Like for example, if you were to go into the chat and you just said like for example like exclamation point. Uh, if I just said one of my social medias like Twitter. Uh, Nightbot pulls it up. He just hooks you up. and So you can interact with Nightbot and ask him questions and stuff like that. Since you're a mod, if you were to actually pull up exclamation point commands, you should get the software itself. And then he'll give it to you and tell you what the available commands are. We've also done things like playing music on the channel and all that stuff. Like, man, there's so many things I'm so excited to share with you, dude. Like, I understand that nothing's ever going to be perfect. I understand that, like, if I stream early, you might miss it. But tell you what, man, is I'll try to, like, make not only stuff work, like, a, like a consistency thing, but also mix things up every now and again because I want to make sure that you can tune in. Oh, uh, by the way, last thing. This is also the big last thing, at least on the Twitch side of things. I could go on and on and on, but it would be here forever. Plus, also, I want you to find out some of the stuff on your own for yourself. Uh, the last thing is that also we have now Twitch watch parties solid. So what we can do is that we can now watch movies on the Twitch channel. It's a thing that you don't necessarily have to be affiliated for. You can just do it for free. Amazon owns the rights to Twitch. How like Google owns the rights to YouTube. So with the, the Twitch guidelines and rules. As long as you follow it. I can stream movies on the channel now. So what I want to do once a month. At the beginning of the month. Is have a watch party movie night. Where I will end up picking a movie. Or we'll pick a movie together. And I'll set it up on the Twitch channel. So that way I have my face cam in the upper right above the chat. And we just play whatever movie we want. And we can all binge it and watch it together. It's really, really cool. We got one already preset. The one movie that we're going to be watching is on July the 3rd. It's going to be Fight Club from 1999. And it's going to be uh, playing at some point, I believe, uh, in between the evening time. Uh, probably it's going to be available in the morning for you because I know about time zones. I'm thinking about, like, maybe 5 o'clock Eastern. Not a guarantee, but it's uh, what I'm shooting for, at least in my head preemptively. Uh, but, yeah, uh, if you end up having Twitch Prime and you end up having the, the movie available in your region, I don't know if it's available in Australia, uh, you can watch it with us. Just link your Twitch account to your Amazon account and get Twitch Prime. And then just make sure the movie is available in your country and then you should just be able to go to my channel at the same time. You could just watch movies with us. Of course, obviously, that's the thing about if you you know got you know, like an account that says you're under 13 or under you know 17, you might have movie restrictions. I think you're an adult, so I think you shouldn't have a problem watching a rated R movie. Uh, but yeah, man, so many things, so many things. Ooh. So someone wants to kill me. Yo, let's kill this fucking ghost. I'm the ghost. I see you found the channel points. 
What's up, G? To the Garden of the Gods, so they may witness his death. Yeah, I'll, I'll even beat you to the hydration one. Kill me, I'll go to the Garden of the Gods and end this. So, Solid, you said you're still doing school stuff. Uh, I'm glad though that you are passing. I, I do appreciate you give you uh, kudos for having good grades. But uh, what you been doing in your personal life, homie? Because I'm pretty sure you don't necessarily want to talk about school all the time. But even though I am proud of you for that, but uh, like, are you also like doing well in your personal life? You got anything like going on, like where you're uh, chilling with your buddies? Or, like you uh, doing anything like with your uh, personal life that you got any like hobbies? Are you still been playing games? Like, how's your PS5 doing? I know it's a lot of questions, but I'm just curious. <laughs> all right, that's gotta be where he is. He's gotta be at that smoke. So let's jump down. My lord. So he should be around here in this area, and it's gotta be by that smoke, I have a figure, right? Wait, which stream avatar are you even? Oh, you became no. Sub-Zero, that's who you became. I keep forgetting that's random unless you pick one. Oh, this is kinda cool, what the hell? Yeah, I was wondering why the hell there's fireflies everywhere. So yeah, he's gotta be over here. He was just here. You saw the spirit? Where did he go? Toward the garden of the gods. That must be why all the fireflies have gathered there. Where is the skull? Vengeance. Yakawawa's vengeance has come for you. Yorikawa, my bad. Statues of the gods. This must be their garden. A shrine. No spirit. This note's addressed to me. Why do you look like you're a member of the Ku Klux Klan? <laughs> Yorikawa's vengeance has come for you. So you're the spirit. I am the wind that stirs the ashes. I'm streaming, Turner. I'm streaming, Tina. Can't open the door for you, baby. Sorry. You spill blood using a technique that died with the clan of traitors. Who are you? A samurai's daughter? Did you survive the rebellion? No one survived. This is a land of ghosts. Are you sure about that? Who asked you to kill me? The peasants who bow to you. The merchants who Why is everyone also watching? So the spirit of Yakawa. So it's like, is someone's Yagawa daughter, maybe? Prays for the death of Clan Sakai and Shimura. Not everyone. Yeah, I'll Some kick your ass, girl. I don't know what the hell is with you putting your sword I away, though. Like, why does everyone put their sword away? Fuck you, fu fuck you, lady. I don't care what spirit you are, or whatever, or how many people you murder. I'm just gonna kick your ass. Are you sure about that? By the way, Solid, I completely forgot to mention to you like what the game we're playing is, because I don't remember the last time you were here. And to be honest, like, I don't remember what game you were on. I think it honestly it might have been Fortnite, or at least for story games. Because that I think that was at the very latest uh, back in uh, like uh, January 2020. Or. Or 2021, my bad. Are you sure about that? What are you doing? Learning. We got the Dance of Wrath. I know how to defeat you. No. No. You will die. Uh, I didn't have time to do anything when all comes to the personal stuff. No worries. You were a Greek Six pages left and I'm done. Okay, I respect that. I didn't have time to play the PS5 much since May. Yeah, I can respect that. School sometimes just takes up your, your uh, personal life. I can understand, man. I just always try to find time to play games whenever I want to just relax or just chill. I sometimes understand that people work so much that when they finally do have free time, they're just exhausted. 
but like i use that just to, to refill me because i enjoy playing games i enjoy playing video games it's just my hobby it's just it is me i love playing video games but uh yeah i also uh don't believe i don't remember when you tuned in last solid i remember i dm'd you a while back i, I just i think the last time i seriously saw you consistently was fortnite because i know you really liked that game was save the world at least i think we ended that in january 2021 if i'm not mistaken yeah and now it's uh june almost july so yeah it's been about like six months but uh yeah now we're on ghost of uh tsushima uh solid this is a japanese like mythology game that is exclusive to the playstation you can you can check this out if you want to uh you should have it available to you basically what it is that we're playing as jin sakai we're a samurai that's trying to liberate japan from the mongols uh without spoiling too too much in case you want to catch up the story on your own I have all of them still on my YouTube channel, all the, the videos and everything like what I do with all my walkthrough series. Uh, basically, the idea is that we're trying to liberate Japan from the Mongols that invaded us, and we're playing as Jin Sakai, the samurai. We're trying to like rank up doing side quests right now, we're trying to get some powerful abilities. Uh, the end of the game is almost here, by the way. The, uh, the last two main story missions I'm putting on hold temporarily while I do side quests to rank up. Uh, but that might not be for a couple weeks now. So I just want to let you guys kind of know what's going on in case you want to, like, figure out what game I'm playing. It's also the third person, too, which I know that you said that you really like, so. So it looks like that the dancing one is just the bumpers, and then you interact with who you want to go for the target. And then that's the heaviest strike, and then that's the longbow. So now we just need the flame sword. Okay. So that is done by the undying flame mission.